In fact, many economists, I think, would argue that um, that if, the, if, the, if a technology is put before a company and they don't adopt it, it's because it wasn't a good technology. But what we were able to show in our research is actually we, we, we came up with a technology that we're quite confident is, is good, we gave it to companies, and many of those companies did not adopt. So that became a puzzle, which we then uh, tried to explore about why is it that this no-brainer technology, a technology that seems obviously efficiency enhancing, uh, wouldn't be adopted. There are many reasons why companies may not um, be, be able to adopt or be willing to adopt a new technology, but what we and our research focused on, which we found was important uh, in Pakistan among soccer ball producers, was that, uh, that there was an organizational conflict, basically, that the workers who were involved in using the technology, in our case, which was a new way of cutting pentagons from sheet, rectangular sheets of artificial leather uh, called Rexon, so the employees who were involved in using, using that technology didn't have an incentive to adopt it. They were getting paid piece rates, the, the technology was slowing them down, and so even though it was reducing waste overall and it was you know, in creating surplus for the firm, those gains weren't being, weren't being shared with the workers, uh, and so the, and the workers were realizing that, and at an exchange, we're, we're blocking it. We're trying to block the technology in various ways, including by telling their employers that the technology was no good. So generalizing to other situations, employers need to think about what, what the incentives are that, that, that employers are facing. Now, it may not be possible always to figure that out, and so employers should also think about setting up general uh, arrangements, general sort of employment contracts, where, uh, where there's profit sharing, or there's gain sharing of some sort, where uh, that workers can be confident that they're going to share in the gains of technology adoption. Um, and so the employer, it may be too complicated for worker to, for, a, for employer to figure out for every technology what the incentives are and adjust incentives for every technology, but if they have sort of a general framework in place where workers are confident they'll share in the gains, then our research suggests that technology adoption process is going to be easier, it's going to be faster, and, more, and the, the, the firm itself will be more dynamic.